Hey, what's up guys? This is Joe from Fandroid and today I wanted to show a quick, cool, interesting app called App Cloner. Uh, so this app does exactly what the name implies. It clones apps and there's a few different reasons why you might want to do that. We'll get into that a little bit later on, but first, how does it work? So when you open the app, you're going to see these columns. The first one is installed apps. The second one is cloned APKs. We don't have anything cloned yet, so that's not showing up there. Uh, but this is a list of installed apps on your phone and you can install pretty much any of these. Uh, you can clone any of these, I should say. Uh, for this demonstration, we are going to clone the Fandroid News app. So when you get to this page, uh, this is where you're going to basically differentiate the cloned app so that you can tell it apart from the app that's already installed on your phone. You can do that in a number of ways. I can change the name. Let's say I want to change it to uh, just Fandroid and all uppercase. Or yeah, we'll just do that. <laughs> um, and then you can do things like flip the icon uh, or we can even change the color. So you can kind of adjust the color. We'll go with a bright pink. Uh, and there's a lot of other stuff you can do here if you unlock the full version, which is four bucks. Uh, but we're going to just keep this right here. And when you're done, you're going to hit the check bar, check button. It's going to clone the app and basically download the APK. So now that it's downloaded that cloned APK, we can install it. Now we're going to install it like you normally would. You can already see that the icon and the name have been changed. Uh, so first, before we open it, you can see in my app drawer here that now I have two Fandroid apps, one pink, one regular green. And this is the Fandroid app. It works just like it should. Um, and so why would you want to do this? Why would you want to clone an app? Well, this is a good example. So let's go into the Fandroid app that I already had installed. You can see that I have the theme customized and stuff like that. And I'm uh, logged in with my Discus account so I can leave comments. Well, this app doesn't support multiple accounts. So if I wanted to have another Discus account, I would have to log out and then log back in with that one. That's kind of a pain. So what I can do is have myself logged in on this app and then open the cloned one and I could log in with a completely different account and these two apps would continue to operate independently. Uh, and so that's basically one of the main things you're going to want to do with this. It's free to do most of this stuff. It's really interesting uh, if you want to do multiple accounts like I was showing, um, but there may be even other uses that I haven't thought of. It's called App Cloner and it's free. Give it a shot. Thanks for watching guys.